Lord, on behalf of our Papa, His Eminence, the Archbishop Nicholas Duncan Williams, we welcome you to One Million Strong Prayer Watch. We bless God for each and every one of you from wherever you have joined from. We want to encourage you to invite your friends, invite your loved ones, and let's come together and pray, lifting our petitions before God, calling upon the name of the Lord our God, for He is a God who has said, when we call, He will answer. We thank God for today and for always. In Jesus Christ's mighty name. Beloved, today we are declaring God's realignment upon the nations. God's realignment upon the nations. In Jesus Christ's mighty name. But we want to give God thanks and give God praise. We want to honor the Lord God Almighty. For truly there is none like our God. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. For one moment you just want to thank God. Please open your mouth and give God thanks. Give the Lord praise. For truly he is good. And his mercy endures forever. For Deuteronomy chapter 32 verse 3 says. Because I will publish the name of the Lord. He says ascribe ye greatness unto our God. Therefore we want to ascribe greatness unto the Lord our God. We want to magnify his name. Him, declaring there is none like him, there is none to be compared unto him. Verse 4 says, He is the rock, his work is perfect for all his ways are judgment. God of faithfulness, God of truth, is without iniquity, just and, and right is him. Our God is the God of faithfulness, he is without injustice, he is good, he is upright. Therefore, we want to honor him, ascribing greatness to our God, giving him glory glory, giving, giving him honor, giving him praise, for him alone is God, he is a rock, his work is perfect, all his ways are judgment, he is the God of truth, he is the God of truth, he is without iniquity, he is just, he is right, our God is just, our God is faithful, our God is upright, our God is good, our God is gracious, our God is merciful, he is the Lord God of us, there is no none like him. There is none like God. There is none to be compared unto him. He is the Elohim. He is the ancient of days. He is the grace I am. The God that speaks and he comes to pass. We want to honor our God. Please for a moment just lift your voice in appreciation, in thanksgiving, giving glory to this God who is mighty, who is awesome, who is righteous, who is faithful, who is a rock, who is a strong tower, who is a high in place, who is our provider? He is the El Shaddai, he is the rocker, he is the rocker, the Lord our banner and the course Keter. We bless you, our Father. Thank you, Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you, Spirit of the Living God. We worship your majesty, your God, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Son of the Living God. Hallelujah! Hallelujah. We are declaring God's realignment upon the nations. Hallelujah. Like the Bible admonishes us in 1 Timothy 2, verses 1, 2, and 3, he says, I exhort, therefore, the first of all supplications, prayers, intercessions, and giving of thanks be made for all men, all men, for kings, and for all that are in authority, that we may lead a quiet and peaceable life in all godliness and honesty. For this is good and acceptable in the sight of God our Savior. Therefore, we want to lift the nations before God. We want to lift up the rulers before God. We want to lift up before our God any man, any woman that is in a position of power that has any say over our nations. We are lifting them before God in the name of Jesus Christ. We are praying also for, our, for the peace of our Jerusalem. According to Psalm 122, verse 6, we are praying for the peace of our Jerusalem. Wherever you find yourself, in whichever nation you find yourself, we are praying for our nations, for the nations of our world. We are commanding peace. We are declaring peace in the mighty name of Jesus Christ that God will cause wars to cease. Even in Jesus Christ's mighty name, let there be peace. Let there be tranquility in the name of Jesus Christ. We are praying. We are asking God that the Lord will intervene. That the Lord will step in into the affairs of our nations in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Karaska Son of the living God. And like the Bible says, like God said unto 
Cyrus. In Isaiah 45, we are also making declarations concerning our presidents, concerning our rulers, in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ, that the Lord we anoint them, that the Lord we anoint them, that the Lord we anoint them, as we bring them, each and every one of them, under the influence of the Spirit of God, as we bring each and every one of them under the power of the Holy Ghost in Jesus Christ's mighty name that the Lord God Almighty he will hold up their right hand in Jesus Christ's mighty name that God by our God they will rule by our God they will rule by Jehovah by the hand of God they will rule in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth son of the living God we give you thanks of God and we give you glory even in Jesus Christ's mighty name we want to pray for God's mercy over the nations. We are praying and asking God for mercy, that the Lord will have mercy upon our nations. In the name of Jesus Christ, we are also calling for godly realignment. In the name of Jesus Christ, godly realignment and order over the nations. Godly realignment. We are commanding order. We are commanding order. We are commanding order in all our nations. All the nations of our world, we command godly realignment and we command order in the name of Jesus Christ as we ask God for mercy. Please let's open our mouth and let's pray. Let's talk to God concerning our nations in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, son of the living God, the whole oh Lord our God. Have mercy, God. Have mercy, Lord, upon our nations. We lift to God the nations of our world. We lift them one by one before your throne of grace, before your throne of mercy. We call out to God for mercy. Have mercy, O God, upon our nations. Have mercy, O God, upon our rulers. Have mercy, O God, upon every man, every woman in authority. Have mercy, O God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Son of the living God, as we pray, O God, for godly realignment. We ask in the name of Jesus Christ for godly realignment. Godly realignment for our nations in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Son of the living God. We call of God for order over our nations. Godly realignment, divine orders, divine order, divine order, divine order of God in all our nations in Jesus Christ's mighty name. As we call upon your God for salvation, salvation, oh God, in the name of Jesus in our land. Oh Lord our God, save our land. Salvation in our land. Salvation, salvation, my God. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Son of the living God, let your mercy prevail for the nations of our world. In the name of Jesus, O oh God, by your mercy, we command divine realignment, divine realignment, divine orders, O oh God, for all our nations, for all our nations, for all our nations, using, O oh God, our nations, O oh God, the nation in which we find ourselves as a point of contact, as we pray, O oh God, for other nations, my Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, oh God, divine realignment, divine godly realignment, divine orders in the name of Jesus Christ, by the message of our God, by the message of our God in Jesus Christ's mighty name, we ask, oh God, for salvation, salvation, oh God, in our land, salvation in our land, salvation, salvation in our land, divine realignment, divine realignment for our nations, for our nations, divine order. Divine order, Kabolo Shata, Father, divine order, divine realignment, divine order, divine realignment for all our nations, oh God, in the name of Jesus Christ, we call out for divine realignment, we call out divine orders, divine order, 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 divine order in all our nations, in all our nations, Parazagada, yes, Lord, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Son of the Living God. Oh, hallelujah. We are praying for teachers. Beloved, we want to pray for teachers. We are praying for doctors. We are praying for elders. We are praying for chiefs. We are praying for... 
for all in authority. We are praying in the mighty name of Jesus Christ for lawyers. We are praying in Jesus Christ mighty name that the Lord God Almighty will show each and every one mercy. That the Lord God Almighty will empower each and every one to do what is expected of us in the name of Jesus Christ by the hand of our God, by the hand of our God, that every man, every woman, every lawyer, every doctor, every man in authority, every woman in authority, we are praying for the elders, we are praying in the mighty name of Jesus for our chiefs, every man in authority, we are praying in Jesus Christ's mighty name that by the power and authority of the Holy Ghost, we will do what we are, what is expected of us to the praise and glory of Jehovah in Jesus Christ's mighty name that we will all realign to the purpose and the counsel of Jehovah God in Jesus Christ's mighty name. Please, my woman, just pray. We are praying, Marek Qatar. Pray for the nurses. Pray for the teachers. Pray for the architects. Pray for each and every one in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father God, in Jesus Christ's mighty name, we bring, oh God, everything, oh God, we represent before your God as nurses, as doctors, as lawyers, oh God, as chiefs, oh God, as the people in authority, Jehovah, as the parliament, as parliamentarians, oh God, Jehovah, we bring ourselves, oh God, before you in Jesus Christ's mighty name that you will empower us to do the right thing. We bring, oh God, the builders, the architects, oh God, before you, Jehovah, we lift each and every one, oh God, and everything we represent unto you, Jehovah God, empower us, empower us, oh God, to do what we ought to do, what we are supposed to do, to do the right thing, Father, that your glory will be revealed, that your power will manifest in the mighty name name of Jesus Christ, oh God, we pray, as we bring ourselves, my God, under the influence of your spirit, under the influence of your spirit, in the mighty name of Jesus, oh God, we bring, oh God, the dietitians, oh God, before you, the bankers, oh God, we bring, oh, we bring all before you, Jehovah, empower us, oh God, to do the right thing, to do what we must do, oh God, that we shall see development in in our nations, in the name of Jesus, oh God, the development that will bring you glory, the development that will bring you honor, yeah, Lord God Almighty, in Jesus Christ's mighty name, we pray for students, oh God, we we touch everyone, Father, in the name of Jesus, oh God, we touch everyone, oh God, by our prayers, my Father, in Jesus' name, empower us, oh God, empower us, oh God, to do the right thing, we bring the journalists before you, you empower us, oh God, to do the right thing, our Father, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Son of the Living God. We are our soccer in Jesus Christ's mighty name. We want to overturn every time sensitive plan of the enemy to destroy us at any gate of decision, gate of authority, gate of blessing in the name of Jesus Christ. We say in the name of Jesus Christ, I overturn every time sensitive plan of the enemy to destroy us at any gate of decision, gate of authority, gate of blessing in the name of Jesus Christ. Say as I clap and pray, I command by prayer in the name of Jesus, let every sensitive plan of the enemy against us be destroyed. Let every time sensitive, time sensitive plan of the enemy in the name of Jesus Christ, by the power and authority of the Holy Ghost, say be destroyed, be destroyed, be destroyed, be destroyed. Be destroyed. We destroy, oh God, every time sensitive plan of the enemy against us, oh God, against our nations, oh God, against our leaders, oh God, against the authority, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, oh God, every time sensitive plan, oh God, to make us miss it, oh God, to make us go the wrong way, Jehovah, to bring us under bondage, we override it by divine authority, God, in Jesus Christ's mighty name, we thank you, Jehovah God, that peace will prevail in our nation, peace will prevail in our nation, peace will prevail in our nation, oh, by Father, in the name of Jesus, we pray, oh God, for 
our leaders that we hear the voice of God and they will rule with wisdom. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray for our leaders and I declare by prayer our leaders that we hear the voice of God, that we hear the voice of God and they will lead with wisdom. Say, my God, in the name of Jesus Christ, I declare concerning our leaders that we hear your voice of God, that we rule with wisdom, that we rule with wisdom, that we rule with wisdom in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, son of the living God. Their decisions of God will bring us peace. Their decisions of God will bring us tranquility, my father, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, son of the living God. In the name of Jesus, say, Father, we pray against bloodshed, civil uprising, and strikes. In the name of Jesus Christ, say, Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, we pray against bloodshed, civil uprising, and strikes. In Jesus Christ's mighty name, say, Oh Lord, my God, I intercede to avert political, economic, and social instability and rest in the name of Jesus Christ say my father my God say as I pray I decree and I declare say I decree and I declare any bloodshed is overridden any bloodshed is overridden assignment of bloodshed is thereby overridden is thereby nullified in the name of Jesus Christ say assignment of any civil uprising I nullify it say I, I nullify it and I come against any power behind strikes say I come against in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, son of the living God, say I avert political, economic, and social instability and unrest. Say let it be averted, let it, O God, be averted by the power and authority of the Holy Ghost in Jesus Christ's mighty name. Say my God, I pray for the safety of our security forces. I pray, say, oh God, I pray for the safety of our security forces. Say, oh Lord, my God, I intercede and I avert political, economic, and social instability and unrest in the name of Jesus. Say, my God, I pray for the safety of our security forces. Say, oh God, I lift up prayers for the safety of our security forces, the army, the police of God. Say, my Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, say, right now, I pray against the the surge of new COVID variant. Ah, Baraskata. Say any rising. Say any rising. Assignment of new COVID variant. Say I override it. I override it. In the name of Jesus Christ. Say I cancel all that deadly pestilences. Say, I cancel other deadly pestilences as I enforce the word of God. No plague, no plague, no pestilence shall come near us in our nations in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, son of the living God. Say, my God, I pray for the poor. I pray for the needy. I pray for the widows. I pray for the widows of our land. Say, oh God, I pray in the name of Jesus for the poor. I pray for the needy. I pray for the widows, for the widows of our land. In the name of Jesus, as we call upon you, arise to their help. Arise to their help. Say, oh God, arise to the help of the poor. Arise to the help of the needy. Arise, oh God, to the help of the widows. To the help of the widows of our land. Say, oh Lord, my God, arise to their help. Arise to their help. Arise, oh God, arise to their help. Arise, oh God, God to the help of the orphans, arise Jehovah, arise O God to their help, Father. Arise O God to their help in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, son of the living God. Oh, hallelujah! Blessed be the name of the Lord our God. Say, I pray for families. Say, Oh Lord our God, let families, oh God, submit to you. Say, Oh Lord our God, all the families will submit to you, oh Lord our God, and honor you in all their ways. Say, Oh Lord my God, all the families will submit to you, Lord. All the families will submit to you, Lord, and honor you, my God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, oh God. Say, Father, strengthen families. Say, oh God, our Father, strengthen our families. Fortify families. Strengthen
strengthen families. Say, as I clap and I pray, my God, strengthen families, fortify families, strength, oh God, strengthen families, fortify our families. Ah, Balagadaya, Lekabaya, Suriata, Ikeboroshka. Father, in the name of Jesus, help us, oh God. Help our families, oh God, we pray. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Son of the living God. Blessed be the name of the Lord our God forever. In the name of Jesus, please say, Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus, I petition you for peace and mercy upon our nations. Say, oh Lord, my God, I petition you. Say, oh God, my Father, my heavenly Father, say I petition you in the name of Jesus Christ, oh God, for peace, for mercy upon our nations. In Jesus' name, say, my God, forgive our sins and the sins of our leaders. Say, oh Lord, our God, merciful and gracious God, forgive us, forgive us, forgive us, oh God, of our sins and the sins of the leaders. In Jesus Christ's mighty name, say, oh God, let let there be salvation and healing in our land. Say, oh Lord, let there be salvation and healing, my Father, in our land. In the name of Jesus, say, oh God, send prosperity into our land. Say, oh Lord, my God, say, oh Lord, my God, send prosperity into our land. In the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ, say, Father, in the name of Jesus, I am arrest the spirit of famine, of poverty, of drought and hardship in my land, in Jesus' name and I break the spirit of ungodliness say I break the spirit of ungodliness, holding our nation captive in the name of Jesus Christ so all spirit, please say all spirit of ungodliness holding our nations captive say be broken, say be broken be broken, I break your hold over our nations. I break your hold in the name of Jesus. I break your hold over our nations and I deploy the blood of Jesus Christ. Oh, I deploy the blood of Jesus Christ right now over our nations, over our nations, over our nations in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, son of the living God. Say in the name of Jesus, I declare those who seek to hurt our nation, let them be arrested by divine authority. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, those who seek to hate our nations, say, let them be arrested by divine authority. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Son of the living God, say, I declare in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, they will not progress. Say, our enemies, the enemies of our progress, they will fall. Say, they will fall. They will no longer advance. They will not progress against us, but I command them by prayer. Let them fall. Let them fall. Let them fall. Let them fall. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Son of the living God, say, let the spirit of unrest be restrained, overthrown. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Son of the living God, say, Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, say, I call our nation blessed. I call our nation blessed. Our national resources overflowing without limit. Say, my God, in the name of Jesus, I call our nation blessed. I call our nation blessed. For the Bible says, the Bible says, when God made, made animals and things, God brought them, he brought them to Adam. And it was whatever name Adam gave to them that God called them with. Say, I declare, I call my nation blessed. Say, I call my nation blessed. I call my nation blessed. I call my nation blessed. Say, in the name of Jesus Christ. I call my nation blessed. I call my nation blessed. I call my nation blessed. Therefore, all shall see that my nation is blessed. All shall call my nation blessed. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, son of the living God, say, Father, in the name of Jesus, I declare the throne and the scepter shall not fall. 
in the hands of wicked and unreasonable men. Say, my God, I pray concerning my nation, and I declare in Jesus Christ's mighty name that the throne and the scepter of my nation shall not fall into the hands of wicked and unreasonable men. In Jesus Christ's mighty name, it shall not fall. It shall not fall into the hands of wicked, of evil men, of unreasonable men. In the name of Jesus, Say, I declare the scepter. Say, I declare the throne and the scepter of my nation shall not fall into the hands of evil men, into the hands of wicked men, into the hands of unreasonable men. In the name of Jesus, say, I enforce it by prayer. I enforce it by prayer. I enforce this by prayer. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, son of the living God, say, let the wicked that rule the people lose their power. Say, let the wicked that rule the people let them lose their power 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 in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth son of the living God say let the righteous rule oh God let the righteous rule oh God say oh Lord my God give our leaders our chiefs our rulers and Lord makers hearts that are sensitive to the cry of the people in the name of Jesus Christ say oh Lord my God say oh Lord my God put your fear in the heart of our leaders that they may serve with empathy and humility of spirit in Jesus name say oh God preserve our security forces and those who watch over our borders say my God preserve them protect them strengthen them energize them Lord in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth son of the living God say I command the release of angelic reinforcement and angelic assistance for the righteous in the land say oh lord my god in the name of jesus christ i command the release of angelic reinforcement and angelic assistance for the righteous in the name of jesus christ in the name of jesus christ say i declare god's blessings increase peace and prosperity upon our land in the name of jesus christ of nazareth son of the living god we bless god for our god is faithful we honor of God that he truly answered prayers. Father, we thank you for the strength to pray. We thank you for grace in prayer. We thank you, God, that you have answered us. We give you, O oh God, and only you all the glory, all the honor, O oh God, all the praise in Jesus Christ's mighty name. Take all the glory, Lord, all the honor, Lord, and all the praise, our Father, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. We have prayed with thanksgiving. Hallelujah. On behalf of our Papa, His Eminence, the Archbishop Nicholas Duncan Williams, we pronounce the blessings of our God upon you and your household in Jesus Christ's mighty name. Amen. Amen and amen. Hallelujah.